Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've ever found yourself frustrated because your TradingView chart just isn't moving, you're definitely not alone. Today, I'm going to guide you step by step on how to fix a stuck or frozen TradingView chart so you can get back to analyzing price action without any hassle. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know exactly what to check and how to get your charts flowing smoothly again. So let's jump right in. The first thing I want you to take a look at is the interval setting up at the top of your TradingView screen. This is one of those things that can easily slip under the radar. If you're used to working with daily or monthly candles, you might not even realize your intervals are set too slow for the kind of market movement you're expecting. Why does this matter? Well, on higher intervals like days or months, the price won't appear to move much in real time because each candle is representing a large chunk of time. If that's the interval you have selected, it's completely normal for the chart to feel static. So here's what to do. Click on the interval menu at the top and try switching to a lower time frame, such as seconds or minutes. For example, if you're day trading or just want to watch price movement as it happens, dropping down to a one minute or even a five second interval can make all the difference. The chart will update more frequently and you'll start to see those price movements pop into view. Give it a try, even just switching from daily to hourly or minute intervals makes a huge difference. Next, let's focus our attention on the price scale over on the right hand side of your chart. This is a quick and easy checkpoint. Take a look and see if there's any visible movement happening as price updates. If your price scale looks frozen or the numbers aren't changing, it's a good indicator that your chart isn't updating properly. Sometimes the price scale itself can get stuck or compressed, especially if you've accidentally zoomed in too far or dragged the chart off its usual axis. If you spot this, don't worry, it's very common and easy to fix. Now here's a little trading view trick that can help you recenter and refresh your chart. Look for two small buttons right on the price scale, one that looks like an A, which stands for fit data to screen, and another with an L, which toggles the logarithmic scale. The A button is incredibly useful. Just give it a click and your chart will automatically adjust its scale and fit all the recent data neatly into view. This helps if you've accidentally pushed the chart off to one side or zoomed out too much. The L button, on the other hand, switches your price chart between a linear and a logarithmic view. This can sometimes help if the price movements seem distorted or out of proportion. It's not strictly necessary for fixing a chart that isn't moving, but if you're doing technical analysis, sometimes changing between these views gives you a clearer picture of what the price action is really telling you. And that's basically it. It's often just a matter of making sure your interval is set right and that your price scale is behaving as it should. Don't worry if it takes a few tries to figure out what's causing your chart to stick. Once you know where to look, it becomes second nature. I really hope this helped you solve your TradingView chart issue. If you found this tutorial useful, please give the video a thumbs up. And if you have any questions or if you ran into any other problems, drop a comment below. I read everyone and I'm always happy to help. Make sure to subscribe for more straightforward trading tips and walkthroughs. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.